Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, Karibu Sana, my name is Penny Charles and for my returning subscribers, thank you so much for always being here. I don't take it for granted. You know I'm on holiday and I promised you guys to give you all the tea. Of course, I've been posting on my stories, my Instagram feed, uh, my WhatsApp and I've received a request to give you a budget of everything. Now, the plan was to go to Salt Lake, then go back to Nairobi, but uh, I decided to go to Taita Hills and spend one night, and that was not in the plans, but uh, I, I mean, the, 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 everything was so good, such that uh, I even decided to extend. So let me give you the budget. First of all, as I mentioned, I came here via the SGR. If you want to come here, I find the SGR the easiest way to come here. You can take the SGR, you can drive. And as I mentioned, I'm not very sure about the airstrip. I'll maybe ask and maybe uh, update you on my Instagram. And before we continue, if you have not followed me on Instagram, please do so. My Instagram handle is penny underscore IG. So I took the SGR from Nairobi. I'm going to give you a budget over uh, everything i came with the sgr from nairobi to voy sgr first class was 2130 then from voy the hotel picked me up they always arrange for transfer if you don't have your own means and the transfer is 2001 way so two way is so two way is 4000 kenyan shillings i hope we are together at this point so after they pick you uh, from the SGR, they take you to the hotel. As I mentioned, you check in at Tighter Hills, then you uh, then you go to Salt Lake. So because I've been to Salt Lake and Tighter Hills, we are going to start with Salt Lake. After they pick you up, you check in at Tighter Hills. That is where all the check-in uh, happens. Then they transfer you to Salt Lake. If you want to come back and stay in Tighter Hills, they'll still arrange the transfer. Once you pay the 4000 uh, for transfer these other transfers in between you don't pay extra they arrange the transfers as well if you want to come from uh, Taita Hills go for a game drive to Salt Lake they pick you they they basically arrange the transfers okay so let us start with Salt Lake uh, Salt Lake I paid accommodation 14,000 for a single room because I'm a solo traveler and I traveled alone so many people don't believe I travel alone by the way but uh I cannot start explaining myself. If you believe me, fine. If you don't, then <laughs> too bad. But anyone can travel alone. And I actually enjoy traveling alone. All right. So uh, accommodation was 14000 And uh, that was inclusive of park fee. Stay with me. I will explain. 14000 inclusive of park fee of 500 So you can basically say the room is 14. Um, so you can basically say the room is 13500 And then the park fee, 500 Kenyan shillings. So that makes it 14000 That is for one day. The 14000 is inclusive of meals on full board. So once you pay the 14,000, you're good to go. Breakfast is provided, lunch is provided, dinner is provided. So it's on full board. Once I paid that, I didn't have to pay anything extra. And upper accommodation could be quite inclusive of park fee. As I mentioned, guys, they also have a game drive and the game drive is 2,000 Kenyan shillings and the game drive is optional. If you don't like game drives, you don't have to go for it. And also, if you want to go for more than one game drive, you can as well do that. But each trip is 2500 So it's upon you to choose whether you want to go for one game drive or two game drives. You can go for as many as you wish. And each time you pay 2500 for the game drive. The game drive, as I mentioned, is optional. But honestly, you do want to go for it. It was such an amazing experience. When I was here, I just did one game drive and that was enough for me and it was enjoyable. It was amazing. I went with a guy called uh, Joseph and he was amazing. He was giving us the history and, you know, like filling us in on everything that we needed to know uh, while at the game drive. So I can highly recommend it. It's just so refreshing. And I went for the 6.30 a.m. one and it was nice. I woke up with a lot of energy okay so that is the game drive and that is the package for one day at salt lake 14,000 plus um 14,000 for accommodation 
meals on full board and during each meal you get to have one soft drink if you want anything extra if you want to take some wine if you want to take some you know cocktails those ones you pay they provide them but you pay so for ten thousand plus four thousand transfer plus uh, 2500 that gives you 20500 that is for one day you can add the sgr charges and i booked first class first class to boy was 2130 so everything for one day for salt lake gives me 22630 now now that is upon you if you want to do two days if you want to do three days if you want to do four days now you decide but that is a budget for one day sgr transfer four thousand accommodation fourteen thousand and uh, game drive two thousand five hundred as i mentioned for the game drive you can decide to go for two three five or just one it is you to decide now you already know from salt lake i went to tighter hills and tighter hills on high season i paid eleven thousand two hundred and the eleven two hundred was uh meals on full board so uh, i did uh tighter hills just one day and that is the only thing that i had to pay because i already paid for the game drive and the transfers and because they are sisters the transfer was sorted out so that was the whole budget if you want to go to salt lake or uh, tighter hills that is a budget now it's upon you to decide how many days you want to be here how many game drives you want to go to how many cocktails you want to drink how many wine bottles you want to drink that will be upon you but uh, that is the budget at least i've given you a budget of one day so how much you spend when you come here it will depend on how many days you want to be around so that is a budget and i've answered all the questions that uh, i was asked about the budget so that is it guys thank you so much for watching and thank you for engaging with my content i was not about to give a budget by the way until you guys asked and uh, it's good because i mean i get to know what you people want to know and i give it to you that is a budget and again i can highly recommend salt lake i can highly recommend tighter hills i had an amazing amazing time i'll definitely come back and stay for more days because i mean this is such a good place to come to just chill nampua wako or you know your friends family or even alone you can just come here alone as i was that is it guys and um if you have any other question you can leave it on the description box i mean if you have any other question you can just ask and i'll definitely get back to you thank you so much and i'll see you in my next video bye bye